this here with all the ice on in the booth at the gate outside when they pull up they give me loose yeah good focus good morning so today is tuesday i am packing i'm basically moving to new york City. One, I'm cutting my wardrobe in half and I'll be posting a ton of stuff on my Poshmark. Like, I'm posting some really of my nice clothes on there. I just like, you know when you've had clothes that so you get really sick of them, but like they're still really great. You just like can't look at them anymore because you've already worn them like one time and then you like can't wear it again. So cute. It's like literally in brand new condition. It's some Harley t-shirts. This is from Topshop. I literally wore it like twice, I think. And currently, I'm having like a little dance party and cleaning sash in my garage. I love you, don't know, believe how much it turns me on. My face looks so puffy. Happy move day. We have everything like packed up. I have banana, I have gum, Lara bites, and I've never tried the caramel sea salt. I have a plant braced protein bar, Hydro Flask, which is empty, which I can fill up at the airport. Downloaded some podcasts. So, skinny confidential, but I follow her on Instagram. And then I also love a podcast. It's called Criminal. It just goes through like different criminal cases, and it's really interesting. <laughs> Today is the main moving day. Hopefully you guys can get some useful tips and tricks if you are moving. And yeah, hopefully I can do like a full apartment tour and a room tour once it's all set up. This is my room. It's completely empty. We have the exposed brick white brick super tiny that's just what you get when you're living in new york city it's actually a pretty good size room there's no ac so we have a window air conditioner also you are into like diys me and my dad are gonna add some shelving to my walls just with some boards that we're gonna get at a local like hardware shop and the bed is gonna go here it's being delivered all today and i'm gonna i don't know how to end this little this is where i get really awkward okay <laughs> Okay, so we just went to the hardware store and then we went to a local lumber place. We just got some screws and brackets. I like the look of it like kind of industrial so we're just going to keep it like this but you could always stain the wood or dry brush paint it. So what we're doing is just putting in the shelf brackets and then just the raw wood that we got from the lumber place. I live on the sixth floor and there's no elevator. So blessed. I did go to Trader Joe's so I thought I would show you some of the things that I got. I did get more like specialty items because we have grocery stores that are closer to our apartment that I'm gonna get fresh produce at. Frozen stuff. I got shelled edamame, vegan veggie burgers. I got frozen cauliflower, frozen blueberries. I heard that this is actually really good to bulk up your smoothies with so I'm excited to try that. I got some Morning Star veggie sausage link. I haven't tried these. If there's any opinions, I'd love to know. Yellow jackfruit curry. And if this is super good, I've had this before. Other things, I got Trader Joe's salsa, I got this olive tapenade, coconut oil, everything with bagel seasoning, vegan mayonnaise, a bunch of um, the Lenny and Larry's protein cookies, and then some walnut brownie protein bars, some natural almonds, some granola, some of this is from Target. Sriracha, oatmeal, olive oil, coconut. I love this mustard and it was on clearance a lot. Green Dragon hot sauce, which I've actually never tried, so I'm excited about that. So that's what we're working with right now. Bed frame being set up right now. I just got this off Amazon and I will link it below in case you are interested. It was super cheap, only like $80. We are headed to dinner right now. We're gonna head in the direction of my apartment. Um, do you wanna tell what you're wearing? Well, this little number, of course, is Chanel. From Anthropology, and this is from J. Crew. Awesome. Shoes by Splendid. Yeah, Splendid. Cute, cute. I'm wearing a t-shirt. Bought a little hottie when I flipped up the shade. Looking like a red rice sitting in the driveway. Bottle of Ciroc with it in a Kool-Aid. She done pulled up like I'm getting rid of it. Are you tired? Good morning and happy Friday. Today is the second day of 
I guess officially moving in. We're just checking out of the hotel and we're gonna head to my apartment and start finishing things up. Sorry, I keep touching my hair. And then my parents are going to catch their flight. That's the game plan right now. They just went to go get some coffee. So our mattress got delivered today. Now we have to carry it up six flights of stairs. just set up my lull mattress and all you have to do is take it out of the packaging and then it literally expands on its own most of the expanding takes place two to five hours fully expanded after 24 hours so far it's like super comfortable even my mom laid on it and she's kind of picky with her mattresses it just makes it super easy especially if you're moving to somewhere like New York City where you don't have the luxury of like a car or a truck I will come back and let you guys know after my first night sleep tonight yeah that's where we're at I think my parents and I are gonna get some lunch and then I'm gonna set them on their way they are going back to Minnesota today starting to get all my clothes in all of this stuff has to go on my dresser I think I should stop buying the color black but I'm not sure you know where I go and we're dancing handshakes in the Hamptons and getting drunk in the hey guys and happy Sunday so my parents left two days ago on Friday but I did want to check back in with you about the mattress because it is fully expanded and I think it's super comfortable but also a good thing to know with the brand is they do have a 100 night free trial as much as a mattress can be recommended to you everyone is different so it's definitely worth giving a try honestly haven't gotten out of bed today I'm just laying low waiting for packages to get here still putting stuff away just wanted to check in Good morning guys, so it is Monday. Today I'm waiting for a lot of stuff to come in and then I hopefully can get finished organizing. I have a dresser coming. I look like a boy. I thought I would just show you what I'm having for breakfast today. I just Ezekiel bread with one fourth of an avocado, sriracha and everything but the bagel seasoning, two Morningstar um, vegan sausages, and then some blueberries and granola. I'm going to wait for my furniture to get here and then I will touch back in with you people. So my dresser just got here and I moved it all upstairs. There are six flights of stairs up with no elevator, so I actually had to disassemble the box like in the entryway of my building and then bring up all these individual boxes and these two are so heavy. I've never assembled something that was an Ikea, so we are just hoping for the best. Slide on a pimp gang with my pinky ring. Lot of gang, lot of bitches in the icy chain. While you claim that you're rich, that's a false claim. I'll be straight to the whip, no baggage claim. Hold. So it only took me literally all day, but I finally finished setting up my dresser. It's from Target. I think it looks really cute though in the space. And once I get everything set up, I will do a full room and apartment tour. But I'm going to end the moving vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Get excited for more content in New York City. If you want to be friends and you live here, just, you know, sign into my Instagram DMs. Thanks. Oh